Is Shopify good for SEO? The term SEO or search engine optimization is the practice of getting as much quality traffic as possible to your website through organic search engine results like on Google. It's some doubt that many merchants like you would love not to waste a fortune to get the right people to visit your store. So SEO is like an ultimate solution for that. And you want to build an online store on Shopify but are unsure about its possibility of helping you with getting organic traffic? Then in this video, I'll give you top 7 reasons why Shopify is the worst to try platform for better SEO and several tips you can use with the SEO improving practice. Shopify gives you a 14 day free trial with no credit card required. So if you want to try it out, you can click on the link in the description box below. And now, let's head to the main part. The first reason is Shopify on-page SEO basics are undeniable. Even if you are an SEO amateur, you can easily make changes to a page meta titles and description with targeted keywords to have ranked higher by Google or other search engines. A great thing about Shopify is that it can give you a preview of how your page will show up on the search results page. Also, it tells you the maximum of title or description characters you should put in to avoid getting cut off on the results page. You can shorten the page URLs as well with important keywords to help search engines crawl your page faster and rank it higher. Next is the headings. Google loves organized content, so with Shopify, you can easily structure your content with heading 1, 2, 3, and so on. Users can also add more tags for their pages and even images, and again, with targeted keywords for Google to read and find their page rapidly. One last thing is with any Shopify plan, you can have free blog features with editable tags, meta titles and description, internal and external links, free hosting, and CDN for images to help with the practice of improving SEO. Following up, the second reason why Shopify is good for SEO is because its size structure is organized. Search engines like Google love to crawl and rank pages higher with organized content. And Shopify is famous for its hierarchy of categories. So your website would be like homepage, and then category pages, and then product page. Also, Shopify can automatically generate a sitemap XML file and create a robots.txt file, which can help Google index your site to get it shown up on the search results page. You can learn how to submit Shopify sitemap to Google in the video that I put the link in the description box below. Moving to reason number three. Shopify can help create 301 redirects and add canonical tags automatically. Broken links like fall for error are bad for SEO, so you need to create 301 redirects to keep your site in high ranking. Shopify can help set up 301 redirects to avoid dead links and it is possible for users to manage them manually. Another plus point of Shopify is the capability of canonizing your URLs to tell Google which is the master page that it should index. And in this way, merchant store can avoid being ranked lower due to duplicate content. Number 4. No worries with Shopify Web Security There will be no tolerance if your store doesn't have a secure socket layer or so-called SSL. And Google would definitely rank your site low. With Shopify, having an SSL encryption is a no-brainer. 
From its basic to advanced plan, merchants will have a free SSL certificate, and the transaction data between them and their customers is totally safe. Also, if you are a European shop owner or your targeted market is Europe, Shopify does comply with GDPR, which ensures that customers can have full control of their personal data with transparency. Reason number five: Shopify stores are mobile friendly. If you forget the mobile version of a site, you are losing a big point from Google. Your site won't be ranked high by the search engine if it's not mobile friendly. At this point, Shopify is good for SEO because when merchants create a store on Shopify and switch it to mobile devices, the layout would adjust to look more responsive on your phone. But it's not just the look and the content that Google will care about. You need to pay attention to your site loading speed as well, which leads to reason number six: Shopify store speed is outstanding. I have done some tests using Google PageSpeed Insight with some of the Shopify store like Flores, Melmotweet, or Terry Blue, and the results are considerably high scores. Remember that Google doesn't like a slow page, so if you want to improve SEO, you better optimize the loading speed of your store right now. Recently, Shopify introduced the online store speed reports in the analytics sections, so you can easily check your speed score, which is by on Google Lighthouse Performance Metrics, right in the Shopify admin dashboard. The last reason: Shopify SEO apps. Well, if you're stuck with the SEO strategy, Shopify has your back. With an immense ecosystem of Shopify apps, you can easily find great SEO tools to help with getting more traffic to your store. Some of the recommendations could be Tiny Image or Avada SEO Image Optimizer for image SEO. Or plugin SEO, which is a complete SEO toolkit with nearly two thousand five-star reviews on Shopify App Store. So those are the top seven reasons to prove that Shopify can arm you with SEO strategy to boost organic traffic. But obviously, SEO practice is what you need to learn and improve day by day to get more and more right people to come to your site. Some of the SEO tips could be optimize your store images with JPEG or JPG files instead of PNG to improve the site speed. You can check your site speed using Google PageSpeed and Size tools. Check if your site is mobile friendly or not with mobile friendly test tool from Google. You can smartly use targeted keyword in your page and blog content, and do keyword research using tools like Arab or KeywordTool.io to know the search volume and the competition of the keyword you are aiming at. And you can also build high-quality backlinks to your Shopify store and remove duplicate content if it's unnecessary. The important thing is you need to learn and change your SEO tactics timely and enhance the process non-stop. I hope you find this video helpful, and if you like it, you can click on the thumbs up or leave a comment to discuss more. And make sure to subscribe to our PageFly YouTube channel. Click on the bell icon for notifications of our latest PageFly and Shopify tutorial videos in the future. Thank you for watching. See you next time.